Tiger Lily convinced Adnan she'd give him children? Will Tiger Lily be okay with Adnan marrying again? Adnan said that he had five sisters and nine brothers and wished to have a large family of his own. He confessed he wanted to have five children, and upon hearing that Tiger Lily acted like she was hearing it for the first time, I think it's not possible for a couple who decided to get married within four months of meeting to not have discussed how many children they wanted. Tiger Lily may have agreed to give Adnan his five children when they started chatting considering he could get a second wife to fulfill his wish if Tiger Lily didn't. Tiger Lily made Adnan pay for the wedding Tiger Lily did spend a dollar in Amman, how convenient. When fans watched the Bollywood-style wedding party that Adnan had arranged for himself and Tiger Lily in awe, so did I. I also found it suspicious that Adnan spent so much on a wedding ceremony for someone he had just met. Tiger Lily should have known from the start what the wedding was going to look like. She'd even carried her different dresses which didn't look out of place at the grand event. I'm certain that Tiger Lily wanted Adnan to make sure theirs was the best wedding on 90 Day Fiancé so they could be called the richest people. Tiger Lily doesn't care about Adnan's precious time. Tiger Lily likes being fashionably late. I've figured out by now that Tiger Lily is used to being fashionably late, wherever she goes just so she can give the appearance of nonchalance and prove her social status as an incredibly busy woman. However, Tiger Lily needn't do it with her new husband, especially after knowing how punctual Adnan is. Tiger Lily even made Adnan wait for four hours so she could get her hair done before a trip to Petra. She didn't need to have her hair done to the nines to visit a place where she was, anyway, going to wear some kind of head covering. Tiger Lily is hiding her first marriage who is Adam Azulai. Interestingly, the controlling husband that Tiger Lily spoke about in episode 1 isn't the only ex-husband she has in her life. According to a report by In Touch, Tiger Lily was married twice before she met Adnan, and once before she met Darren, the father of her kids. Tiger Lily got married to a man named Adam Azulai, who she divorced in June 2011. The divorce did not involve children and was finalized a few months later. Tiger Lily used to have a different name back then. She was called Mariko and not Tiger Lily, which is a name her kids gave her recently. Tiger Lily just wanted a younger husband Tiger Lily was looking for a boy toy. Tiger Lily's choice to marry a man who's two decades younger than her and later complain about him wanting children has been criticized. However, I recently came across an Instagram story by her where Tiger Lily justified marrying a 22-year-old. She listens to a podcast named Divorced Not Dead, where the host had married a man who was 19 years younger than her. Tiger Lily had only dated older men but became open to dating younger people because of the podcaster. To me, it looks like Tiger Lily just wanted a boy toy she could show off to her exes in the US to make them jealous. 90 Day Fiancé I've changed my mind, Tiger Lily is the bigger red flag in her relationship with Adnan. 90 Day Fiancé Before the 90 Days star Tiger Lily Taylor is looking like the problem in her relationship with Adnan Abdel Fattah when I was convinced he was the red flag for the longest time. Tiger Lily is a 41-year-old mom of two from Frisco in Texas. Tiger Lily met the 22-year-old model Adnan on Instagram and sparks flew instantly. I could hear myself gasp when I heard Tiger Lily say she was going to marry Adnan on the same day she arrived in Jordan. Tiger Lily also claimed that her ex-husband Darren had been controlling but saw no issues in Adnan telling her how to dress. I think Tiger Lily's on 90 Day Fiancé to become famous. She just wants to make herself look like an ultraric woman who's better than every other cast member in the franchise. Tiger Lily's created a persona for herself, especially on social media where she's deleted all her old posts to look mysterious. Tiger Lily seems to have a reason behind doing everything. Everything from her choosing to marry Adnan on the first day of meeting him, to her saying she's done zero research about Adnan's religion to her trying to sound like Kourtney Kardashian is very deliberate. Tiger Lily talked about her controlling ex-husband. Tiger Lily could have made up the story for sympathy. Tiger Lily spoke about her previous marriage in episode 1 of Before the 90 Days. She said that she was 30 when she met someone and became pregnant with his child. Tiger Lily married the man as it was the best thing to do, but she called her house a golden bird cage because it was fancy and filled with all the riches, but her ex-husband was very controlling. I have a suspicion that Tiger Lily is making false accusations against her ex because she knows he would never face the camera of a reality TV show to defend and embarrass himself. Tiger Lily is all about flaunting her wealth. Tiger Lily wants to be the richest 90-day fiancé cast member. Tiger Lily said that the divorce took four years and that now, she and her kids are well taken care of. I assume she was implying that she got a lump sum after the divorce.
Tiger Lily was driving a Lamborghini Urus and dropped $26,500 on a one-of-a-kind watch all within the first five minutes of her introduction. Tiger Lily has been dressing up only in designer dresses and takes her hairstylist and esthetician wherever she goes, even while traveling. She also spends hours getting ready, which has already made a bad first impression on Adnan. How exactly does Tiger Lily make her money? Can Tiger Lily afford her fancy hobbies with her handwriting expert salary? Tiger Lily said she was a certified handwriting expert. I wondered if she made enough money through this to afford her lavish life. However, Tiger Lily's Instagram reveals that she has three or more businesses in the U.S. She owns a clothing shop called Nege and runs an agency called 11A. Tiger Lily is also selling a very shady-looking digital marketing course where she promises that one can make money using only their phones to generate 100% profit. I also feel like most of Tiger Lily's 700k plus followers are fake, since her engagement is next to nothing.